introducing to you Sky Hills Master Plan Community. And that's what I'm talking about today. So let's roll. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Angela O'Hare, your favorite Las Vegas realtor. Today we're going to take a neighborhood drive through tour of the newest master plan community here in the northwest part of the valley called Sky Hills. It just recently opened up at the beginning of 2022 and um, we are just getting off the freeway and off of Ann Road and we're going to head west on Ann Road to get to Sky Hills. Sky Hills is actually west of Providence and super close to Sky Canyon. It's not part of Sky Canyon, nor is it part of Providence. Um, so I thought it would be kind of cool to just drive around, show you all the new builders that are gonna, that are in this community. They have roughly around one, two, three, four, five, six, seven uh, new construction communities. The builders in Sky Hills are Pulte, Beezer Homes, uh, DR Horton Express, and uh, Richmond American Homes. So this community has about 270 acres and it's close to the Sheep Mountain Parkway and Farm Road. They're gonna have around, when it's all completed, around 1,600 homes in this community. And they're gonna feature different styles and everything, but there's not really any true amenities. I think they're gonna have a park. I don't think they're gonna have a community center. It's not gonna be as big and elaborate as Sky Canyon, but it's gonna be a pretty decent size. So what we're going to do, or the goal of this is to go through each of the subdivisions or neighborhoods, each builder, go over what those builders are offering, show you what the homes look like, and just show you where it's all at. So as you can see, we're going to take a right on, I never know how to say this word, chamber, chamber. A lot going on over here. And I find it very interesting on the way to Providence and now Sky Hills, that there's nothing to the right. It's very desert. It feels like you're driving <laughs> somewhere far, far away. And I'm sure there's another way to enter into this community, but the only way I really know is to get off of Ann Road from the 215. Now, if you are thinking about buying new construction, it's very important that before you even visit the community that you bring your own real estate agent with you. I say this in a lot of my videos, but I'll say it again and again until everyone's blue in the face, I guess, but especially with the way things are going, the market, it's very important to have an agent on your side. We're free of charge. And my analogy is, would you want to go to court without being represented by a lawyer? Um, especially agents like me that sell in a lot of new construction communities, we have a great rapport with a lot of those agents, the sales reps that work in those communities. And oftentimes we know how to negotiate. There's a lot about negotiations right now, especially with these builders um, offering tons and tons of incentives. So the first community we're going to take a tour of is Talvona by Pulte Homes, and it's an all single story community. We're going to take a left right here on Centennial Parkway. Now this Sky Hills isn't fully developed where you can just drive through each of the communities. We're going to have to um, do some zigzagging to get to each of the neighborhoods. One day soon it'll be a straight row our straight road where you can get to each of the communities. So this is an all gated, Talvona is an all gated community, again by Pulte Homes. They're going to have around a hundred and some change um, homes for sale. Let me see. The floor plans range in size between 1579 square feet to 2462 square feet. Let's go this way. 
and they're gonna have three to four bedrooms with two and a half to five bathrooms and two to three car garages so this this community had opened in the beginning of this year I do believe so there are some people that are already living in this community now I have been doing videos and stay tuned to my channel where I've done a model home tour of all the model homes they have six floor plans to choose from four of them are, are on display um, the HOA for this community is roughly around $47 a month for Talvona and $165 a quarter for Sky Hills um, looks like chaos so I'm gonna flip around now what's going on with this community in particular is they have around 20 25 quick moving homes or what we call spec homes when the market was doing super well a lot of these builders Pulte Toll Brothers Taylor Morrison they specked out a lot of the homes so they were getting ready for the beast or you know a very robust market but once interest rates went up, the market shifted, and now a lot of these builders can't get rid of these homes. So what's happening now, let's take a video of the, the houses. So what's happening now is that they're offering a lot of incentives because they need to get rid of these homes by year end. And some of these incentives are especially with Pulte, they're offering up to 6% towards closing costs. You could utilize that 6% either towards your closing costs or to buy down your points. Um, and they have a lot of great floor plans here. They have the Garden Gate, the Stella, the Bellwood, um, Tifton Walk, par the famous Park Lane. Here are the models. Oh, brownstone as well so if you're thinking about buying in this community let me know reach out to me again we're gonna to go tour all the new construction communities here in Sky Hills so this is Talvona all single-story community by Pulte Homes Now we're going to take a tour of Val Ridge by Pulte Homes and this is just right next door to Talvona and um, they have three different floor plans to choose from. Two are on display. The models that they have here is Palermo, San Remo and Tivoli and the range is in between 2806 square feet to 3440 square feet. Let me see how big the houses are or how many bedrooms I think three to five or three to six bedrooms a lot of these are very big it's also a gated community that offers three to six bedrooms with two and a half to three and a half bathrooms and three car garages the HOA here is $55 a month for Val Ridge and $47 a month for uh, Sky Hills And they're gonna have a hundred and five two-story homes in this neighborhood they also have a handful of what's called spec or quick move-in homes just as I mentioned in the beginning of this video they're trying to get rid of these homes by end year so they're offering awesome incentives one thing about driving through construction is always a war zone <laughs> uh, let's see what else I miss the SIDS are 288 semi-annually, so that's not bad. They do have SIDS, and a SID is called a Special Improvement District. I've done a video in the past about what SIDS really are, SIDS and LIDS. So if you want to learn more, just go to my YouTube channel to learn more about it. So this is, again, just a two-story community by Pulte Homes, and they've been around for a minute. Let's go this way.
Okay, now we're going to get back on Chamber. Chamber. I don't know how to say that. And we're going to go through Providence. I've done a video on Providence in, in a couple years ago. So if you want to learn more about Providence, stay tuned to my channel. And just a little FYI, I've re redone my website. It used to be called SummerlandCommunities.com, but it's now called uh, NeighborhoodsInLasVegas.com. So with my main goals focusing on doing videos of trying to of all the neighborhoods in Las Vegas, including Henderson and North Las Vegas. So this is the first of my neighborhood tours. Obviously I've done numerous neighborhood tours of Summerlin and Desert Shores and Sky Canyons. Um, I will do updated videos of Summerlin soon just because the ones that I did were like three, four years ago. So I like to just stay updated and keep YouTube happy, right? <laughs> but my website is full of awesome information about all the neighborhoods in Las Vegas with listings, information about it, and stay tuned. There will be a video on ideally all the neighborhoods. So we're going to take a left right here, and there are no signs to indicate that you need to go left. I just know because I come up here often. It's called Durrell. We're going to take a left on Durrell, and there's two communities back here. One is Beezer Homes, and the other one is DR Horton Express. Now the Beezer home has two different collections. It has the Sage Point and the Sage Reserve, and it's all in one community, and it's a gated community as well. So then we're gonna go up here, and then take a left. I don't know what this road is called. There's no indication what this road's called. Cool. So eventually, this road is going to go straight on behind this neighborhood and lead to the Pulte community. And I've done a video, if it's not posted yet, it will be posted soon, of all the model homes in this neighborhood. And so the Sky Point, let's see, has four two-story floor plans to choose from, ranging in size from 20, 34 square feet to 27 feet 19 square feet with three to five bedrooms two to three and a half bathrooms and all two car garage then the sage reserve has let me see how many floor plans they have has four single story floor plans and one two story floor plan um, ranging in size between 1750 to 3179 with three to five bedrooms, two and a half to four and a half bathrooms, and all two car garages. There is one floor plan that I like that's called the, the Everett that could either be single story or two story and you add the loft option, which is pretty neat. And they've, um, looks like they've developed for a minute, so let's take some video of the houses and what they look like. Now this community for incentives, I do believe they are only offering, if you use their in-house lender, 3% towards the closing costs. They don't really have any spec homes. They didn't jump the bandwagon like Pulte, Taylor Morrison, and Toll Brothers. So there's not a lot for sale on this one when it comes to um, standing inventory or getting any really decent incentives in this neighborhood. So the HOA for this community is $55 for Sky Hills and $32 for Sage Point. And the SIDS is, I think, $132 every six months, which is pretty reasonable. Now, a lot of these new construction communities, regardless if it's Sky Hills, Sky Canyon, Summerlin, for the most part, are going to have SIDS. Now, if they are one-off new construction communities, not like a very major master plan community, then they're not going to have SIDS. Um, and there's going to be 110 home sites just for the Sage Point. When I went to look at Sage Reserve, the agent didn't have any sheets. Uh, I would imagine that the HOA would be the same because that would be silly to have different HOAs.
they do have a nice community park in this community as well. All right, now we're gonna take a left and then check out Tribute by DR Horton Express. They have one and two story homes, nine different floor plans, three different collections, ranging in size between 1501 to 2988, up to five bedrooms. So the single story collection has three different floor plans. Damn it. The single story collection has three different floor plans. Then they have a mid-sized collection, which is called the Bay, which has three different floor plans. And then they have the um, larger collection, which has three different floor plans. So again, total of nine different floor plans in this community. The HOA is um, a total of $85 a month, which also includes Sky Hills. Um, and it is also a gated community. The SIDS are $196 a month. And this is part of the DR Horton Express collection, meaning that, you know, from what I understand, DR Horton tries to build their homes in 90 days. Once it reaches about 45 days, they will put it on the market. They have okay incentives. The incentives that they have is 10,000 towards closing costs, and then they can offer you a 3.99% rate buy down. Um, so it's not bad compared to other um, my my thing is having problems of course it's not bad compared to um, like Beezer wasn't offering really anything Okay, that wraps up DR Horton Express. Um, I think in the midst of something, I was trying to talk and then I was having, as always, whenever I do these video tours, technical difficulties. The, I have a DJ Osmo and I also have a GoPro and we weren't filming but for 15, 16 minutes and the DJ Osmo overheated. So now I switched to my GoPro because I always like to show what the neighborhood looks like. So DR Horton Express, their homes are built in 60 day, 90 days and with about 45 days in, the homes will be ready. Um, so now we're gonna go to another community called Summerston. There's Summerston Ridge and Summerston Ranch. I don't 100% believe that this community is part of Sky Hills um, because every research that I have done on Sky Hills the only builders that were ever mentioned was Beezer, D.R. Horton, and Pulte. Um, for some reason, the people in Summerston Ridge and Ranch say it's part of Sky Hills, uh, but I don't think so. I'm going to further investigate and maybe call the Sky Hills Master Plan community, see if in fact that these two neighborhoods are part of Sky Hills. Now, Summerston Ridge and Ranch have been around for a little while, and they're actually near uh, closing out on both of the communities. Um, I haven't been there in a long time, so forgive me if I forget where it's at. We're just going to keep on going down this Chambro Road, um, and we're in Providence right now, so you kind of get a little tour of what Providence looks like. And we're going to go there. So, And there's no signs indicating where to you know, turn to. Richmond American Home, Summerston. We'll see. And hopefully the GoPro will last a little longer than the DJ Osmo. So this says KB Home. right there see they never give you the indication of where it's at I have to flip around
Summerston Ranch has four single story floor plans to choose from, ranging in size between 1740 square feet to 2150 square feet, three to four beds, two to three baths, and two car garage. And then Summerston Ridge is also has six single story floor plans to choose from, ranging in size between 2190 square feet to 2800 square feet, with three to five beds, two to three and a half bathrooms and two to three car garages. So this is another gated community and forgive me, I don't have the HOA information or the SIDS. Um, but it looks like that's the community center. They already have listings. They have a handful of listings. I'm not sure what kind of incentives they're offering either, but um, my website at Summerlin, sorry, not Summerlin, neighborhoodsinlasvegas.com, if you go under Sky Hills, I'll have all the listings that are in the MLS for Sky Hills, all new construction, and some of them are for the Summerston. And I don't know which one's Summerston Ridge and Summerston's Ranch, it's just very melded together. Well, that wraps up our drive through tour of Sky Hills. It's not a lot to really look at as of yet. Again, this is a newer master plan community that just recently opened up. And I still will investigate if the Summerston is part of Sky Hills. I don't believe it 100% yet, but I will let you know. <laughs> Stay tuned for that information. Let me know in the comments if you've bought in any of these communities. I would like to know, and if you have, what do you think of your neighborhood? Um, and if you are thinking about buying new construction here in Las Vegas in Sky Hills, you can always reach out to me at 702-370-5112, or I've posted a link to a buyer form down in the description below. Um, I am your new home sales expert. I sell a lot of new construction here in the Las Vegas Valley, and it's always good to have an experience new home sales agent on your side. Thank you so much for watching, but don't forget to like, share, and obviously subscribe to my channel if you want to learn more about all the neighborhoods in Las Vegas. Peace out, and I'll see you on the next one.